list view. Today we're going to read, What Can You Do With a Shoe? What can you do with a shoe? What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a shoe? You can put it on your ear, on your berry leery ear. You can put it on your ear, try la or you can wear it on your head. Or butter it like bread, or use apple jam instead. Ha ha. Oh, stop all that nonsense. What do you really do with your shoes? Of course. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a chair? You can pretend you are a bear saying boo in a zoo or a seasick kangaroo. Now the chair is a canoe. Or use it for a table when you're sitting on the floor. Or if you are able, shove it up against the door. So nobody can get it unless you say so. Or it's an airplane or a train and you're going on a journey to the moon. Now really, is that what you're supposed to do with a chair? What do most people do with chairs? Well, what do most people do with chairs? Oh, that's right. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a hat? You can fill it up with pickles or with popcorn or with glue. An octopus can rest on it. A bird could build a nest in it. A turtle can be a guest in it. Or would a horse look best in it? Oh, don't be so silly. What do you do with your hat? Just what everybody does. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a cup? What can you do with a cup, friends? You can gobble it up. Gobble, 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 gobble. Crunch, yummy, what a lunch. Who ever heard of eating cups for lunch? or even for breakfast. You know what people do with cups, don't you? Drink milk or tea or coffee or orange juice, things like that. Now that makes sense. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a broom? You can use it for a shoe brush. Now a broom would feel really tickly or prickly like a porcupine or a glue brush or a chair brush. I'm sure you have a chair. And it would seem quite scratchy on the batchy of a lion. Pages are sticking. What on earth are you talking about? Just tell me what you do with a broom. What does your mother do with a broom? Hmm, that's what I thought. I hope while we're on your break, you're helping your mothers with the broom. What can you do? What can you do? What can you do with a bed? Well, What do you do with your bed, friends? I can paint it red. Paint it red, yellow, blue, and paint the covers too. Paint purple, orange, brown on it, and then jump up and down on it. Oh, no, no, no. What are beds really for? <sighs> That's right. Good night, sleep tight. That's what beds are for. I hope you're staying healthy. 
my Westview friends. Um, my husband and I are staying at home. We're washing our hands a lot, and we're, we're social distancing. Not on this rainy day, but on the next sunny day, you can get outside in your front yard and exercise. I'm sure Coach Tolly and Coach Taylor would love that when you come back to us in mid-April uh, from spring break and are in shape and you have had a lot of activity. And we want you to know that we miss you and we hope that you are loving online learning. Until next time.